You're like a circle that floats around me, keeping me safe and sound. And when I fall, you've tied a rope to me. You're blessing me every day. I was down with an illusion, like a sparrow with broken wings. But now I shine with your reflection on me. I'm getting back up on my feet. and in today's vlog I'm going to tell you and show you how to pamper your pony so over the couple days I'm going to be pampering Hattie today is going to my local tax store to get some stuff and my local craft shop to get some stuff some like glitter for their nails so I'm super excited and tomorrow we will be doing the actual pamper because I think because it's the hottest day over here it's like a million degrees so I'm so excited and I hope you're excited we're gonna go to the shop now and get some bits and bobs let's go so we've just arrived at the tax store and let's go So this is my favourite tax store and it's not really Mummy's favourite tax store because every time we come here we spend lots of money because we forget how much everything is. So let's go inside. Ooh, these are on sale and they've got they've got juniors. Let's get a pair. <laughs> The only ones I haven't got is the scoop, the scoobold, the dun, and the chestnut one. Ooh. Oh, okay, I'm getting distracted. Oh, so many things. Okay, so let's go and find the pampering stuff for Hattie and Darcy. I wonder where it is. It might take me a while. So I'm not sure it's down this lane. <gasps> oh, the shampoo and stuff is here. Wow, they've got loads of nap. Mini pony pink shampoo. Hmm. Pimp my pony. For perfectly clean ponies, perfectly pink. To prepare to be dazzled. This one is that we have to get this one because Hattie is a strawberry roan and it's pink. It's perfect for Hattie and Darcy. And I think this is gonna be a really, really, really good shampoo. And it's by Naf and it's got one, two, three, five stars. So that means it must be amazing. Ooh, what's this? Razzle Dazzle. Naf Razzle Dazzle. Super shiny finishing spray for the perfect performance. Prepare to dazzle them. Wow. 
I think we definitely have to get this so then Hattie and Darcy can dazzle like stars. And it's night too. And I think this is going to be really good for them. Ooh, I've seen this was recommended to us. NAF On Shine Grooming Spray for the perfect finish. And off to a party. Your horse is, your horse is squeaky clean and ready to go but just needs that little extra sparkle to get noticed in the crowd. Finally mist the coat with the, with the spray. It's great for soaking up manes and tails too, giving your horse an all, an all over perfect finish. The results you will get, you noticed. <laughs> That's so cool. I think we definitely need this grooming spray because it looks really good. Ooh, naff, silk. Silky and mane and tail detangler. This is definitely, definitely need this because Hattie and Darcy's tails are quite knotty and we don't really know how to get it out. So definitely this and it's naff. And we love, love, love all the naff products. So we've got these so far, but let's keep looking. I think this is everything we need for the pampering. So let's just have a quick look around. This is this looks really cool. It's a really cool hairbrush. I think we might have to get this for them because their hairbrush is quite stiff. And it'll be good to have a mini one just in hand in the car. So then from wherever it places and if we forget anything we can just use this so this will be perfect it's the Mure Tidy Tangle Mini a basket so now everything's gonna be so much easier so what we do need is a show number and because we don't really have one and they have a lot of the new numbers over there so i think we'll go and find a number over here put my basket down there okay so this show number is medium and it's perfect and it's so so fluffy this show number i think this is gonna be the best one yet and it's really nice it's also lemieux okay now whilst we're here we have to get some respirator boost for hattie so um, just here and here it is get one of these now respirator boost it's getting a bit heavy that I love and I think they'll be really good for me is this color and I love them and they have a really good grip and they're really really pretty I guess I'll have to put them on my birthday list so now we are going to the Lemure section which I love this section so nice. You've got your sage green, your azure, your musk, and there's some the mirror stuff over there. Oh, 
this is what the, the new tap bag looks like. Wow. This is the one that I've won in a giveaway and it hasn't arrived yet though, but I'm super excited because it looks so cool. And they're so, so pretty. Ah! And all the stuff nearly fell out. Wow. All the stuff is so nice here in the end. This is probably what we could do within this heat, definitely. Okay, I think I'm done now having a look at the, all the Lemure stuff. Oh, look at all the Junior range. Wow. I think this is Lemieux. Wow. All the pom-poms and the, all the hat sets look really cool. I love it and it looks really These are really nice. These are the show shirts and they're really nice. These are the jumpers. These are the base layers and the leggings. They look so nice. Some more things to put on my birthday list. Okay, I think we've got everything we need. But I also got this pony on sale, £10 off, new brow band. And it's so pretty and I think she'll love it because it's so nice. So let's go pay for all this stuff and hope it's not too much money. <laughs> so we've just had a little stop at Starbucks because it was so hot and I got this chocolate crunch um, frappuccino and it's so good and there's no coffee in it I don't like coffee it's too bitter so we are now at hobby craft and we're just about to go in so see you in there let's go ones and I think we should get one for to put all the glitter in so and look how much storage it has you open it like that and it pops up like this and it has loads of storage and you can just pop that up like that and do that up so definitely we're gonna get this because it's really really good so let's go find the glitter now
glitter section. There is so much glitter here. And wow, there's so much. You can get glitter sachets, these ones which you just pop up and you shake. And these bits of glitter. There's so many. Oh, and we also need some of these to make unicorn horns for the pony. So we'll definitely be getting some of these in a minute. Glitter? Let's choose some glitter now. So I'm just going to pick like six different colours. The really good thing about these are that they are biodegradable glitter and there's also special ones called bio glitter which is really cool. And I am a very eco-y person. I love anything to do with being eco so I'm definitely going to get some biodegradable. So I love the silver and, the, and this colour. This is like rose gold, it's really pretty. And <clears throat> get some gold too, gold dust. Definitely get some green, because I love green. Hmm. Hmm. I think we might have to get some of these. This is like a kind of sage. And this is a proper rose gold, which is really nice. And these ones are bio glitter. So they definitely are biodegradable. And we need some of these because these we can put around the ponies for lots to make unicorn horns and it's gonna be so, so, so cool. Um, I think we might get the rainbow ones um, or the glitter ones. What do you think, Mommy? Or the neon ones? The neon ones are good? I think the neon because they're quite brighter and the, for the glitter, hurt a bit more. They're a bit like weird. So definitely gonna get these because this looks so cute. With Darcy's forelock it's so easy to pat but when Darcy's been rubbing she's got a little like scab there. It's not really a scab but I'll put these in here just for now. Just so then we don't have to carry all of them. I think that's us done, so let's go pay. Oops, I got distracted again by the all the art stuff, but I'm just gonna have a quick look because I love art and art's one of my favourite subjects in school. So nice stuff. I love the pens and the colours. I love the gel pens. Gel pens are really nice to use. Canvas is definitely gonna ask for a, some art stuff for my birthday, like canvas and some paint. Cause I love doing canvas stuff for people like like mummy. I would sometimes do her some paintings. Like the, like the other day I did a horse for her. She really liked it. <clears throat> All paid and off we go. Okay guys, so day one done. So I've got all the stuff I needed in here. Whilst we're there, we also got some tape. I don't know why mommy needed tape though. So we all sorted that out. We had to quickly go and get another, another one of these instead of the one we had before. Because I was getting getting frustrated because I didn't know why it didn't shut properly because it didn't have one of these so now it can shut properly which is really really good so that's day one done like I said and I'll see you tomorrow stay tuned bye day two of pampering the ponies and today's one will be will be washing and dazzling Hattie so as you can see all the products we're using are naff and the main one is this pimp my pony shampoo which we'll be using to shampoo Hattie so let's get started so first of all I'm just going to wash her down with the hose um, just so then we get her wet and then we can start using the shampoo. 
So we just start at the feet and then she gets all used to it. And then we can go up higher. All on the leg. Oh nice. She's been so good. She's been such a good girl. I'm nearly done with doing this side of her. I'm just finishing off doing the neck and the bum. So then she's all over. She's doing such, such a good girl. Oops, sorry. And then let's move on to this end. On this side. Good girl. That's all right. You start on those sets of the legs. Just there. Good girl. How are your, how is your, is your pony okay with water or does it not really like it? Cathy likes water but sometimes she doesn't like it by her bum. Too. No, she doesn't. That's it. Good girl. Okay, she's all wet now. You can fill the bucket up a bit. So we're just going to fill the bucket up with some water and then we can put the shampoo in there to start giving her a good scrub. I think that's enough. Do you think that's enough for me? Okay, turn that off and then we can get the shampoo and prop some in there. Now it's time to get the shampoo. Can I get some shampoo? Here is the shampoo. Now pimp my pony. Prepare to be dazzled shampoo. Look how pretty it is, Hattie. Do you like it? I think she likes it. So do we just put it in the bucket or put her on her? Pop it in the bucket. Okay. Tell me when to stop. That's not enough. Then and squidge it all up with the sponge. Okay. Mix, mix. Okay. And now we can sham up. with Steph Zebedee who she breeds Arabs and she is a professional shower so that was so much fun and Hattie did really well we were learning how to ride a show perfectly so then we can do lots more shows which would be good for me and Hattie to learn so when I was there, I also got to see all the Arabs, like the stallion, the foal, and I also got to see a grey that she has, a grey Arab, who came eighth yesterday at his four, first show, and that was at the Royal International. Wow, that was so cool. There's loads of bubbles everywhere. Bubbles, bubbles, bubbles. All foamy. Nice clean, isn't it? I better give these white feet a scrub, means they'll get all nice and clean. Don't want dirty feet. Oh, we're not, we're not doing, we're not, we're not 
not picking out your feet. You don't have to do that. Oh no, here comes. She's trying to drink it. She's gonna drink the water. So I'm just gonna hold her off so all the shampoo is gone and she'll be shiny and squeaky clean. under her tummy where all the water is dripping. My tie, my tend, my tangle tidy mini Lemieux brush. And sniff it. So let's start off with the tail. Now we can brush it. 
so then there'll be no knots in Hattie's tail because normally there is a lot a lot of knots. So the brush is sliding through much easier with the detangler. I think I might need a bit some of the detangler for underneath her tail. So just pop that down and then get this and chisel that over. A little bit on the there. There we go. And the tail. Now, Hattie's tail is going to be zero knots after this. It's so pretty. Hattie, Hattie, stop. Hattie has such a lovely tail. Oh, Hattie! lovely tail because it has lots and lots of colours in as you can see grey at the bottom and white and black and then at the top here there's gold and white and other colours like that so Hattie's tail is really smooth I think I've just got to put a spritz at the bottom just there so it will detangle the bottom of her tail there we go this brush is absolutely great. After we bought this, when, we, when I got home, I had a little try on my hair, so it worked really well. It's really, really fun. So it's working out really well, and I can put my think hands through Hattie's tail and no knots. So this is really, really good. And I recommend this if you're going to a show or anywhere like that, because it's really, really handy and it gets through all the knots. So, because normally there'll be lots of knots in Hattie's tail, but now there is zero. So, she's doing a little bit of tail too. Hattie is being a bit random. I have no idea what she's doing. She might be, Hattie, Hattie, don't nibble the wood. <laughs> having a little yawn. I think she might be a bit tired. The mane, Hattie's mane is normally very knotty, so I hope this will work. Because it worked from the tail, so I bet it will work. Yep, it's already worked really well. So all the knots are coming out. It's really, really good spray. I love it. I definitely recommend it because it is the best ever. And this hairbrush, this main hairbrush, main tail hairbrush is such good. It's the Muir Tangle Tidy Mini. You can get them from any store or any like tack or farm shop. And they're such good. You can even use them on your hair if you like. I'm now going to do her forelock. Probably gonna spritz a little bit on here on the on the brush so then I don't have to spray it on her forelock. So just spritzed a bit in the hairbrush so then I don't have to spray it on Hattie's face just in case it got in her eyes. So that works out really well. I'm just gonna brush it all over here because sometimes Hattie's mane likes to go a bit of it over here and the rest over there. It's a bit crazy sometimes so this is working out really well. Good girl, Hattie. Hattie's been such a good girl, apart from the chewing of the wood. <laughs> good girl. I think she might be having a little snooze now. She's very tired. Just gonna get this out. Head it out, Hattie. Hattie. There we go. Good girl. So that's done with the with the silky mane and tail. I definitely recommend this. It's such a good product. Now, what should we do next? Hmm. Hmm. Let's try some of this NAF on Shine Grooming Spray. Perfect finish. So now I'm just going to put a spritz on. So 
we can do that side first. I'm just gonna quickly go and get some of one of my brushes. So now I've got one of my brushes. Can you brush the seeds? Is that good? You like the brush? Patty loves being groomed and brushed. So clean. Darcy has lots of hay on her mane and her forelock. I think Hattie's very tired again. So, I'm just getting all of this, make her very shiny. Cute. Hattie is very, very shiny right now. Patty loves to be shiny, don't you, Patty? So now I'm gonna do the other side. I have to get, okay. I'm gonna get the grooming spray. So now on this side, come on, move over. Uh, uh, move over. There, thank you. And now, a bum. So now I'm going to do this side, and Hattie is already looking so shiny. Hope when we get when she gets back in the field, she doesn't immediately have a roll. You like having, you like being brushed, don't you? Find it very well. Hattie loves a good groom. It's like having a servant. You like grooms, don't you, Hattie? You're a good girl, aren't you? Good girl. Hattie look, looks very shiny. Perfect. So guys, that's all of day two, and tomorrow, We'll be doing the Magical Unicorn Makeover for Hattie and Darcy. And it's going to be super exciting because we've got all the glitter and the stuff to make the horns. And it's going to be so cute. So I'm just going to pop Hattie's fly rug on and to keep her a bit clean. So then she actually does keep clean. And then she'll go down to the field tonight and have a lovely rest. <laughs> Hi guys, this is day three of pampering Hattie and Darcy. So day three is we're making Hattie and Darcy into unicorns and this is my little cousin Florence. Say hi. <laughs> and she'll be make makeovering Darcy and I'll be doing Hattie. So let's get started, yeah? Okay, you, get, you, get, you, start, you start with Darcy. I'll help you with the bum in a minute. <laughs> do you like it? Go do on the salt, please. Okay. Yeah? We're, making, we're giving the ponies a makeover. Beep, beep. And I'm trying to now push Hattie over this way. So I can do this side. Beep, beep. Beep, beep. Why are you pushing Hattie the other way? Because I have to do both ways. So then both ways are clean. Then you can start with the... Yeah, Darcy has a sore nose from when she's been rubbing on the fence, like her normal routine at the night, when she likes to rub. 
So I'm just brushing Happy and after we've brushed both of the ponies and we've done their mane and their tail, we can get started with the makeup. So if we hold it up and do it because she's got a bruise, what are these well, not bruised, what but these, cut there. What are these things for? They're her whiskers. <laughs> like a cat, but she's not a cat. She's a horse, isn't she? Of course she is. <laughs> so we've done her full lock and I'll just do her messy mane. Yes, like a zebra. Zebra. Now, and I'm going to help with this side a bit. Where she's I just squished a fly with this brush, and it was very disgusting. It's Try to bite horses, and I don't think Darcy would like it. Would you? And she'll she'll be frightened. Right? No, that brush is for the mane and the tail. yesterday and um, we're going to use it on Darcy. Darcy hates any spray so I'm just going to spray it onto the brush and then Florence can spray it, put that onto her tail there. And Hattie doesn't mind being sprayed. You're doing a really good job Flo. Is it a bit tangled? Yes. We're going to give it a try on her tail because she can't really feel the bits on her tail. Charlotte wants to be in this video too. Zebra unicorn, isn't she? Can I 
Let's close the door. Okay, now we can do Hattie. Razzle dazzle. I'll hold her still, shall I? Finishing spray. Just bring her round. Do you brush it? Just bring her. Like you can that. directly spray her onto a soft cloth. <laughs> and keep her still. Okay. Do it onto a brush. Baby, can I do it? Yeah, you do Darcy, I'll do Hattie. Do not go by the eyes. Not on the saddle area, otherwise the saddle will be so slippery. Mm -hmm. She looks all nice. There. And I think we might need to push it in a bit. Okay, how super shiny. So shiny. Yeah, I'll spray it onto the brush for you. Okay, I'm going to brush down 
Lucy. Both sides. And don't brush by her eyes, okay? Okay. Because it says avoid eyes, so that means don't go by the eyes. to make unicorn horns. Yes! Yeah, yes. you stay there, I'll go and get them. I'll just come on that one. Do you love Darcy? Yes. Darcy, do you think it's food? That's how you do it. Yeah. And you put your hand on a grown-up's hand. You put like a, that. A, yeah, you put a hand under a grown-up's hand and then you let them eat. Yeah. yeah. So in the magic box we've got all our glitter. Yeah. And here we've got our unicorn horn makers, which will we will be making a unicorn horn. So, Florence, what colour would you like? Pink. Pink to start off with, okay? Yeah. And then I'll help you how to make it. So, you choose your colour. Pink? Yep. one I just made her, um, a double twisty one. It's a bit harder with Hattie's because she hasn't got as much as Darcy. So what I might have to do is pull a bit of the main through, but I'm okay for now because I can just with the pipe cleaners I can make I can eat can I'm holding Darcy. You're holding Darcy. I'm holding Darcy. Who's this Hattie? Hattie holding Hattie. I'm gonna do a bit of blue there so it's like a bubblegum rainbow kind of thing. Get a bit more on the bottom and it actually looks good. You want her to look good. 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 We want, we want these horses to look good, don't we, Phoebe? Yeah. Because we want her to look good. Hattie to look good. And these two horses to look good. Phoebe, can you help me with mine? Yeah, because I've got these. And I'm going to put them round on here. Round on there. Do you want to make them a rainbow? Yeah. Okay. 
put mine on there. Then look, you've got all these really cool colours to make into a rainbow. I want to mix it with my mother. Next time we'll get some white. Next time we go and get some of these, we'll get I'll get some white and then we can make clouds. And then they can be a full rainbow. Darcy looks super amazing. Thank you. I'm gonna make a little rainbow. Okay, you have an eight? Yeah. Do you want to give Darcy what? Do you have? Yeah. Do you, yeah. Want, give her Do you want to make a rainbow like this? Yeah. Okay, I'll come up in a minute then. Darcy? I'll get a bit of yellow, get a bit of green. I'll get a bit of that one. Like you've got, and then I'll get a little pink one. I'll get light pink ahead. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get two more of these, so then I can tie them at the end, yeah? Yeah. What have you got to say? Hello. How are you? How are you? Delete. Delete feed. Delete feed. Oh, yes. Dark sea shake all her made out. Now to do it again. Because he looks amazing because she's got beautiful and she's got a beautiful. On perfectly good, thank you, Flo. This is a lump of stone. Stone her mane. She looks so cute. She looks a bit like a telly tubby. <laughs> <laughs> making little hearts for Hattie and then Florence can make some little hearts for Darcy. We've run out of the pink because we've used too much pink. So we'll just have to use blue and the other colours. Well, I think, yeah, we've still got lots of blue. There. So these two hearts are done and then I can use a bright colour like this and thread it through to make the these little double hearts which look really cute and they're like little dream catchers if I put this over them like that
chicken biscuit, Florence? Yes. Is it yummy? Mm -hmm. Not real chickens, but it's shaped and icing, icinged like a chicken, so no chickens were harmed in the making of that biscuit. So, yeah. <laughs> Nearly done with the hearts. So, here is the hearts, and I'm going to put it here. Just there. And then just tie that like that. there i think the ponies are all glammed up now now we need to glitter their hooves <laughs> are we gonna do the hoof glitter now yes hoof glitter. not yet don't grab the glitter yet um, get the hoof oil. now we're going to do horn horse that the hoof stuff we're going to do the hoof stuff oh, be careful <laughs> put it on the floor so we do not Tip it over, okay? Okay. Because it will be splashed on us <laughs> all over Phoebe. And you. Then are we all over you. Oh, okay. Um, should we do Hattie Tooth now? Yeah. Okay. Actually, let's do this too. Phoebe, let's do that. No, we'll do, we'll do Hattie's first because Darcy is a bit uncomfortable with her doing her feet. So I think Mummy will have to do it. So you have to paint it all over so then the glitter has something to stick to. Mm. Doesn't it, Florence? Yeah. Should we do the glitter now? Yeah. Yeah. Do, then get the glitter. Mm. do you think we should use the rose gold on her too? Yeah. And that foot, yeah. And this glitter is biodegradable, yeah. so. Can we do it on that? We can do it on Darcy in a minute, yeah? Yeah. So we'll do this. We'll do this too. Cool it looks. Patty's rose gold feet. It's so shiny. Yeah. So shiny on its feet. Don't touch it. You be bouncing. You <laughs> bouncing like a ball. Bouncing really fast. <laughs> okay, now let's do. Ooh. Yes, we can do Darcy after we've done Hattie, yeah? Yes. And you see all her hoops and then, then, yeah. then it's done, isn't it? We can, should we do this hoof on the other front one? Mm-hmm. Okay, let's go around this side. This way. Okay. Do, do, do you want to paint it on her feet there? Do you want to hold it? Yeah. Do you want to paint it? Yeah. Don't paint it with a fur, just paint it. Thank you. Go. Do you need any help? Just go. 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 Do you want me to do that bit? Yeah, we'll do that. Do you want to do that bit a little bit there? Right there? Do you need help? Nope. We're doing the floor. Oops. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Right, then go. We should go. I'll help with the top. I'll go and fix it up. I'll go and fix it up. Oh, no. I don't know. You're going to hold that? It's like a... Magic, it's like a magic brush, isn't it? It's all magic green. Then you can do all Darcy's, yeah? yeah? Magic green. Magic sage green. It's different, isn't it? Yeah. Those are not oh, magic. I need some of these to do in there. I mean, this to do the back. You want that there? Thank you. Oops, I'm going to fix it. Up. It's got mermaid green, isn't it? Yeah. And that's got the rainbow sparkle, hasn't it? Yeah. Rose gold. Do you like rose gold? Yeah. Rose gold on that side. Green on that side. Oops, a little bit. Oops. Done. Done. We're doing a limbo under Hattie's neck. Oh, yeah, right. that way. Okay, Hattie was very good with that. I think she's very happy because sometimes she's a bit funny about that kind of backfeet. And she kicks, doesn't she? She thinks there's a fly and she knows. No, she won't kick. Only if you stand behind her bottom, she might. 
and she thinks there's a fly um, standing on the floor. And then she kicks, doesn't she, Phoebe? Yeah, sometimes she will. Sometimes she will not. Right. What are you singing, Florence? Oops. Oops, what? Pardon? Oops, what? Oops. I know what I'm going to do. Oops. <laughs> I'm going to fix it up. Oops. I know what I'm going to do. Oops. I'm going to fix it up. Oops. I know what I'm going to do. Oops. I know what I'm going to do. I wipe my hands through her tail so her tail will be all glittery and so then I can wipe my hands. <laughs> I can come this. <laughs> oh, so I'm going to fix it up. Oops, what am I going to do? Oops, oh no, what am I going to do? Oops, I'm going to fix it up. Oops. Oh no, what am I going to do? Oops, I'm going to fix it. Oops, oh no, what am I going to do? I'm going to go. Now I'm just going to have to fix these up because Hattie rubbed a bit. So that means her unicorn horn would have. Her unicorn horn has flopped. So take it out and try and do it. Really? Gotta understand. Oops, I'm going to fix it. Oops, oh no, what am I going to do? Oops, I'm going to fix it. Oops, I'm going to fix it. Oh no, what am I going to do? This is a disaster. I don't know what to do. I got under her neck. Now we need to do the back 
Oops, I'm gonna fix it. Oops, I'm gonna fix it. Oops, I don't know what I'm going to do. Oops, I'm going to fix it. Oops. Phoebe? Yeah? I can't do it because she's got two cross legs. Yes. Yeah, let's put her on. Yeah. I've done on the back of her feet. I've done the back of her feet. How does that look, Phoebe? The back that looks great. I just need to do a bit, a bit more sprinkling and then it's done. Like a magic, magic, magic unicorn. Sprinkle, 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 Like a magic unicorn. I think that's enough, Florence. Oh, that's glittery. That's glittery. Oh, you think that's, a, I think that's done. Oh, that's glitter on her back. Now she looks like a unicorn. That's Darcy the unicorn, and then that is Hattie the unicorn. Well, she hasn't got spots on that. Well, she's got wow on her. Thank you guys so much for watching my glamorous, me and Florence's glamorous unicorn sparkly video thank you guys so much please subscribe like and turn the notification the, the notification bell on and hope you watch some more videos bye Yeah.